What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Bax. Welcome to another playthrough. Uh, we're we're gonna we're gonna give this we're gonna give this a shot. Like, what on earth is this? Uh, so this is World of Horror. I mean, I don't, I'm looking, there's so much, this is, this so much. Um, let's go ahead and go to new story and let's give this crazy thing a try. Would you like to customize many color palettes and display modes to choose from? Oh, I think two, two bit. Oh, oh my. Well, that would be horrifying. Let's just, I think this one was the normal one and we're gonna go, we're gonna go two bit. We're gonna go two bit. We gotta get that two bit out here, right? If that's your first time playing World of Horror is recommended you start with the spine chilling story of school scissors before trying more complex playthroughs. Easy, random. Okay, so we'll go normal and we'll do spine chilling. A tiny second of standard playthrough showcase one of the available mysteries. Okay, let's do it. You guys ready? Um, Something strange is happening in our town. Robed figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. People are going missing. Disgusting creatures are terrorizing the seaside. The rapid technological progress of the modern era brings comfort, but also new unknown threats. Old gods, malicious, eldritch beings who ruled the earth eons ago are awakening as reality starts to crumble. Okay. Armed with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity. You'll investigate mysteries across the city and in realms beyond. Okay. An old train slows down and stops at its last station. The end of the world is at hand and you finally arrived in the doomed town. Okay. Um, welcome to the world of horror. Important messages will appear here. Excellent. Cauterize. That's good. Um, no active rituals. Good. Uh, here's our person, apparently, with our stats. We have 17 stamina and 17 uh, re sanity. The story so far. You've been following the weird cult for weeks now, barely surviving the encounter with the skin hag at the nursery. It's a race against time and you can't rest until our town is safe. Start the mystery. Oh my God. Um, they do say in there that this is a... Uh, this could be a shout out to Junji Ito, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Uh, he is a master of horror illustration in story form. If you aren't familiar with Junji Ito, J-U-N-J-I-I-T-O, please go look up his work and just prepare to maybe be a little disturbed. Uh, some of his stuff gets uh, pretty dark and his drawings are quite detailed. Um, Spine chilling story for uh, school scissors. Another boy from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it a terrible woman has returned from the grave. A woman with the widest smile and the sharpest scissors. You knew your friend was up to something when he left you his notebook full of cryptic notes. I can send her back where she belongs, he claimed. After he disappeared too, you decided to study the notebook for clues. Okay, details of ritual that can stop the wicked one once and for all. What's the worst thing that could happen? True. Let's investigate. The school is eerily quiet at this hour. Your missing friend has left you a notebook. If the rumors are true, to stop the tall woman with scissors, you'll need to perform a ritual to force her material form to appear in our dimension. 
Accomplishing this requires first the drawing of an Eldritch Sigil and then the lighting of holy candles. You can only hope your friend has left them somewhere around the school. You started a new mystery. Okay, so we are now in the mystery. This is us. Here we go. Access your storage, explore school, perform the ritual, check out the school lockers. Let's explore the school. You are investigating anatomy class. You hear a faint sound while walking outside the biology classroom. Inside is an old anatomy model. It's heart beating. The sight almost makes you sick. Minus one stamina. Day. This is where we are. School, word of horror, base game. Okay. So resolve. Okay, so that was us doing that. Okay. Um, blessed chalk, not found. Holy candles, not found. You feel like something horrible is happening within the school. You must hurry and find the items. What's in my storage? Friend's diary. Oh, okay. So now we have the friend's... Maru is acting strange. I need to talk with her after class. I hope she didn't attempt the ritual herself. The sigil can weaken the demon for a while. Careful with the lines. I've hidden the candles in one of the classrooms. Tomorrow I will perform the ritual. Okay. Other pages seem irrelevant. Okay, so one of the classrooms. Let's continue our investigation. You've discovered non-Euclidean 101. Impossible angles and seemingly moving lines make your head spin. Stare in disbelief needs an ally I don't have, so I will stare in disbelief. Charisma check success. How is this possible? Minus one reason. Uh-oh. You found a digital page for your friend's diary. It seems that the blessed chalk was left on the roof. You must hurry and find it. Okay, so let's go. Let's peek outside. You found an additional page. Okay. To open the door, click on the handle and drag the mouse with the mouse button pressed. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. New achievement unlocked. You shouldn't risk that again. <laughs> It's like, no, 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 you don't understand. You can't do that. Okay, well, we can't go there, so check out the lockers. Okay, we'll start with this one. Oh, you need a tiny key to open this locker. You found a wooden bat. Excellent. Equip. Equip wooden bat. <laughs> Please, for the love of God. Wait, no, 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 no. What? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Slot A. Excellent. Okay. Oh! What the hell is that? We still need the tiny key there. Um, Not too interested in whatever's going on with that. So... Let's continue. Maybe. I think I have to keep... Wait, we found another page, right? Of the diary? Oh, wait, it's right here. Um, Place item in storage. Is there a way to turn the page? I don't think so. Cool. Cool. All right, let's continue exploring the school. That's all we can do, right? Dead man's float. You enter the damp smelling sport wing. You notice a backpack drifting on a swimming board in the middle of the pool. Could it be what you were looking for? Oh, this. This isn't going to end well, team. A bloated figure emerges from the murky water, blocking your only way out of the pool. Fill the combat sequence with moves and click launch sequence to attack your enemy. The bloated teacher. A 
attack without a weapon, prepare your attack, attack with your weapon. Need a firearm, attack, but an attack has additional 10%. Okay, so we want to attack with our weapon. Attack, 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 just so many attacks. Oh, I see. Spiritual actions. What can we do here? Clap? We can combat rich. Okay, let's just launch our attacks. Turn two begins. Eight HP remaining. Again. Wait, another turn. He's he's dead, right? <laughs> you bashed bloated teacher. You defeated bloated teacher. You found blessed chalk, which you can use to draw the sigil. You copy the sigil as best you can on the blackboard. Hopefully it'll be enough. That sigil looks awful. Okay, we need candles. Classroom. That's where you, suddenly everything gets silent. The cursed chants amplified by the cave system make you dizzy. To your horror, you notice the sound has awakened something else. What the hell? Um, time warper. Minus one to all, so minus one to stamina and reason. So how much and 20 HP, so can we strong attack? A couple strong attacks out there? And then, what, that leaves us with 16? Look for an improvised weapon? Let's just, okay, a couple strong attacks, huh? And then we lose one of each, okay? So those did six apiece. So if we do a strong and a normie, that should end it, right? You missed the attack? Well, that's not good. You've defeated Time Warper. The sound of scissors is getting louder. Uh-oh. Well, I'm trying to... Investigating corridor, I'm trying to get to the thing. As you enter the school gym, you notice a strange black doll propped up against the wall. Oh God. Against your better judgment, you approach the doll. What you see makes you gasp and horror. The doll isn't a doll. Your sudden movement causes tiny black spiders to flee, revealing a white half-eaten corpse. We're gonna, we're gonna nope, we're gonna nope that one. You found the holy candles in your friend's backpack. You lit them as instructed by the notebook. Everything is ready for the ritual. Let's perform the ritual. Wait, what's that? Ah! Oh my God. What the hell? The sigil and holy candles don't seem to have any effect on the horrible monster. Have you drawn it wrong? Frozen in fear, you watch as the twitching horror gets closer and closer. It raises its enormous scissors and croaks. Am I beautiful? Twisting and twitching, the demon woman enters the classroom, cackling menacingly. Am I beautiful? Oh, God. Um... What are our support actions? Okay. Well, I think I think we're just going to go on the on the attack here, right? Next attack is a guaranteed hit. 
This effect stacks. Boom. Let's do that. So we prepped, and then we went for the swings. Okay. Uh-oh, look. We even get cuts. We're eight and nine. We're gonna do this and do a couple strongs again. Oh, we're close. Okay. Next attack is a guaranteed hit. I mean, that ends it, right? Scissor Woman stabs you pretty sure. Okay, you defeated the Scissor Woman horror. Ancient horror lies dead on the classroom floor, slowly dissolving into nothingness. The only thing left of her are the large scissors. You stare at them, unsure. Ooh, sure. Ooh, sure. What to feel. Something tells you you want to keep them. You need them. Very slowly, you pick up the scissors and your mouth widens in a smile. We, we are. We are the scissors. The horror is over for now. Um, your playthrough lasted 14 minutes and 21 seconds. Not the only mystery plague in this town. You must continue your investigation. And we've found the cursed scissors. Okay. Um, well, that was this game. I hope that <laughs> uh, if that seems uh, if that seems spicy for you, it's currently available on Steam and early access, and it actually is also on Xbox Game Pass. The Xbox Game Pass also has put it up, I think, yesterday for access, uh, still in the early access as well. Uh, feel free to give it a shot. Uh, we may come back to this and give a couple other stories a shot in the future. I'm not too sure, but I did want to get at least a little bit of a taste of what this was because I really like Junji Ito's comics. I find them quite mesmerizing. Uh, so, that being the case, I'm Bex. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to the channel and show your support. Join the Discord, too, because we talk about stuff in there. Talk to you guys later.